Hello and welcome to VRA how to tutorial series. In this short video, we explore how to render a paper lantern using a VRA two sided material. Let's start by creating a VRA material for the front side of the lantern. We can start an IPR render to see the changes updated immediately. I'll call this material front side. Then, Create a file texture and load the paper image. Connect the texture to the diffuse slot of the front side material. Assign the front material to the geometry and see how it looks. Let's make a new V-Ray material for the back side of the lantern and call it back side. Add a file texture with the backside paper image and link it to the back material's diffuse slot. Now, let's see how the backside material looks like when assigned to the lantern. It looks good, so it's time to create a V-Ray two sided material. Assign it to the geometry. The lampshade of the lantern disappeared because the two sided material has no front and back materials yet. Find the front side material and set it as the front of our two sided material. Then add the back side as the back material. Let's tweak the translucency. See how the lantern changes when we change the translucency. When we use a darker color, the front material becomes more visible than the back. When we use a lighter color, the back material is much more visible than the front. You can tweak the color to get the desired look. Let's leave the translucency to a mid-gray value. Now we can do some final tweaks to our scene. Select the sphere light inside the lantern and change the color mode to temperature. Make the light warmer and yellowish by setting the temperature to 3500. We also need to increase the intensity. A hundred and twenty seems perfect. Select the rectangle light and again change the color mode to temperature. Make the color bluish and colder and set the temperature to 9300. Now, let's render the final image in the VFB. Thank you for watching how to make a paper lantern with V-Ray for Maya.